Hey guys and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a hair and makeup get ready with me. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe and let's get to it. So I'm going to start off by using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit and I'm going to use the color Coral to apply my orange color corrector. So I'm just going to use my hands because why not? Like, why not? <laughs> So now I'm going to use my Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade in the color Dark Brown. I absolutely love the dip just because it goes on pretty well and it lasts forever, guys. I've had this for so long and I really feel like I've used nothing. So, um, you really do get a run for your money and it lasts for a long time, like I said. So yeah, check it out. So I'm just going to continue working through my brows. I don't have the thickest eyebrows, so um, this product really helps give me what I want. And yeah, I love it. So it's coming together when your brows are popping. I'm going to go ahead and use my LA Girl Pro Conceal in the color Fawn. Just go ahead and clean up my brows. And this is why it takes girls so long to get ready. <laughs> so we're just going to keep on blending out our eyebrows. And then we're going to take our blender sponge and we're going to use Lancome in the 460 Sway color. Blend, 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 blend. I love Lancome, y'all. Like, it's my holy grail product to love. Love. Look at that finish. Look at that. I'm going to go ahead and use my Tarte as a concealer under my eyes in the color tan. What? What? <laughs> I'm literally giving myself African princess tribal feels right now. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and take my blender sponge and just blend it all out. Make sure it's all blended and I don't have any harsh lines anywhere. Y'all, we all have that one purple that is tries to come and destroy your destiny. Like, why? Why? Why must you be an enemy of progress? God forbid. Anyways, back to blending. I'm going to go back in with my contour cream kit and I'm going to contour my cheekbones. I'm going with this shade, I'm not really sure what it's called, but I will put it in the description bar below, so make sure you check it out. Now I'm going to be using my Sephora liquid liner. I love this liner, guys, because it's just so perfect for winged liners and anything you'd want just to be precise. I've been using it forever. Like, when it finishes, I just go right back to Sephora and buy some more. I'll put the full name of the eyeliner in the description bar below. I'm going to be using my Lash Sensational by Maybelline. I also love this brand as well. I'm going to go ahead and use my favorite line as well. Our lashes are the bomb.com. I'm going to use dual glue and I'm going to apply that to my lashes right here. Lash glue takes forever to dry, like goodness. 
so the good part about this lash glue is that it does dry clear so even if you apply it to the wrong place it don't matter because guess what no one will ever know that's why I love it so much I'm gonna go ahead and blend out my face real quick and then I'm gonna go ahead and put on some more Mercier powder and the color translucent. Now I'm going to go with my favorite highlighter, guys. Do not judge me. I dropped it, and this is the result. So it's the Revolution Strobe Highlighter, and I love it so much. It's in the color, I want to say Gold Digger or Gold Addict. Yeah, it's in the color Gold Addict. I love it so much. It's really good. Um, I've actually been really impressed with the way it works and how it comes on. But cracked or not, y'all, it's still the bomb.com. So, yeah. And it's cheap. It's low budget, y'all. I got it at Ulta, and I will put more of the information in my description bar below. I'm going to go with my favorite, well, one of my favorite lime prime lipsticks. It's in the color Salem, and I've had it for years. I don't wear brown lipstick often. Or just kidding, I do. But I have a lot of different types, so I never wear this as much. But this is definitely one that I can say is high quality, and it just it's just really good. It rolls on really smoothly, and it smells so good. So now I'm going to be using my eyeliner pencil that I got from Sephora. I don't know the exact name of it, but I really think it's a Sephora brand. It was on sale for like 99 cents, and I just had to get it. So I'll put the full details in my description bar. It also has like a smudger end, so I'm going to go ahead and use my smudger to kind of give me the effect that I'm going for. Now I'm going to use my NYX white crayon for my eyeliner, my under eyeliner. I'm going to be using this blush. a super old blush I don't really remember all the details to it but I'll put it in the description bar below so you guys can see now I'm going to go back in with my fawn concealer just to kind of give my lips a pop I'm gonna spray my elf setting spray and now it's time for my hair so this is a very very quick twist out I literally put it in the same day and I'm taking it down the same day I didn't use much product, but I will be doing a tutorial on how to style your toit. And yeah, I just really, really liked this because it turned out really good. And I didn't do a lot to it. So I can't wait to share with you guys how I style my hair and how I really just get it to look like. Especially for my 4C sisters. You know, it could be a struggle. So I got y'all. I will make a video about that and hopefully it can help. I'm going to go ahead and put in my side part. I've grown to love these side parts so much because they're just so cute. Like, I never thought I'd like side parts, but honestly, I'm in love with them. They're just so adorable to me. Like, what? Of course, you know, I had to get that Gorilla Snot Edge Control Gel out. I'm beginning not to like it as much. So if you guys have any other options for... Any gel that would work with coarse edges, please put it in the description bar below so I can go pick it up because I'm looking for new options. But for the meantime, I will be using my Gorilla Snot Gel. And here is the finished look. I love it so much. 
Hairs popping, teeth popping, cheekbones popping. Come on, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe and watch my next vlog to figure out why my day now outfit was a fail. All right, guys. Peace out. Bye.